So we want the temperature that will give us the same numerical reading for both Celsius and Fahrenheit. We can find this by taking the relationship between Celsius and Fahrenheit and basically solving it like an equation where Tc and Tf are the same. So the relationship we have for Fahrenheit and Celsius is that the temperature in degrees Fahrenheit is equal to 9 fifths times the temperature in degrees Celsius plus 32. But since we're specifically looking at the case where Fahrenheit and Celsius have the same reading, let's say that both of them are equal to the same variable x. So x is equal to 9 fifths times x plus 32. So to solve for x, let's get both of the terms containing the x on the same side of the equation, and then get the 32 on the other side by subtracting. Basically, we're just solving this using standard algebra. So I'm going to subtract 32 from both sides of the equation, and I'm going to subtract x from both sides of the equation. So one side of the equation becomes 9 fifths x minus x, and the other side becomes negative 32. Now 9 fifths x minus x, so that's just 9 fifths minus 1, which is just equal to 4 fifths x. And then to solve for x, we divide both sides of the equation by 4 fifths. So in other words, x equal to negative 32 multiplied by 5 fourths. It gets flipped because we're dividing. And this is equal to negative 40. So this means that the readings of 40 degrees Celsius, or neg negative 40 degrees Celsius, and negative 40 degrees Fahrenheit are the same. So negative 40 degrees is our answer. That's it for this video. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing or donating to my Patreon, as that'll help me out in making more videos just like this. If you have a question or a request, leave a comment down below, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Bye-bye.